what's going on with this school loan payoff is going to help the country and help your world in the long run. Well, yeah, you're smarter than if you're that college, if you if you're that educated, shouldn't you be smarter than that? Because they're driving us off of a cliff. So hey guys, welcome to Appalachia's Homestead. I wanna drop this video off because I really, really want to encourage you that if you are needing anything for your personal health, anything that's medical, anything for your house, and I'm talking, I don't mean, I'm not talking, you know, Hobby Lobby here. I'm talking about so you can function and live and do the daily things, weekly things that you do, you better get on it. So welcome back to the channel. Oh my gosh, I'm supposed to be making beautiful, beautiful jars of canned potatoes and apples today. And it's just not happening because, you know, you know, it's just like everything happens at one time. And this is touching upon some important subjects that I think that you already know, but I just want to know I said it. You know, you know how y'all are. It's like, I just want to know I said it. So I have been playing major runaround today um, because we are having to have some things done to our house just to be functional. And we set all of this in motion back right after Christmas. Uh, today is August 25th. <laughs> is, that right? is, that, is that right? What day is it? Welcome to Appalachia's Homestead, if I didn't tell you. And welcome back to the channel and welcome to so many new faces. Here's what I want to tell you right now. If you are wanting to do anything to your home that you need to get done, if there's something important that you need to order for your home, your safety, your sustainability, uh, something for you even medically, um, what are you fussing about, girlfriend? Listen to that. It's something all the time. Um, you know, you need to get on it. You need to get on it. I'm chasing contact lenses. Yeah, that's right. That's right. This is why you're seeing me in my little my little nerdy glasses <laughs> recently is because um, they're not making my contact lenses anymore. They've switched me to a different brand. You might as well put Coke bottles, uh, the ends of Coke bottles in my eyeballs. They're horrible. So I'm going through round and round and round of trying to work with uh, my doctor. They can't get the, um, now they can't get in samples. It is a hot mess. On top of that, we're doing home renovation right now. Not because we're trying to be beautiful, beautiful HGTV, but because we had showers that leaked, which caused problems with the shower, caused, caused problems with the floor, all kinds of nasty stuff. The good thing is, is we are fixing it, but here's the deal. So I talked about this on a video, I don't know, a week ago or something. I said we couldn't find any shower liners and somebody actually argued with me and basically said I was making it up. Oh really? Okay, whatever. You can find shower liners uh, or showers, but they are whole pieces. Uh, but the problem is, is we can't do that. Our house is 1975. I think Marsha, Marsha, Marsha visited one time. And so we have to do things in a very particular way in a specific size. And we cannot just bring in huge, big pieces because basically the house was built around the tubs. So <laughs> you should see them trying to take these, this stuff out of this house, okay? So what we have to buy um, the, what is it, the, what are they called? The remodeled three-piece sets, da, da 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 Well, in order for us to get the size that we want, now, I'm, I, I was about to downsize. I mean, and that would be okay. Um, I wanted a, well, actually, I needed a 59 by 32. They don't make that anymore. They make, uh, they make 60 by 30s or 60 by 32. And 60 by 32 is the most desired size you can't find that if your life depended on it okay so we have been everywhere the past several days trying to find a, a, a the four-piece set okay very specific um basically what you're looking at if if we can get one in is basically the end of october unless i'm willing to like drive to another state or something like that today i found one i have told them i'm going to give them my child they better hold that thing I, we are dry, we are having to hook the trailer up tomorrow and we're going to be heading out first thing in the morning in hopes that we have a tub to replace my shower. Now, will my life end? No, I can go bathe in the creek, I guess. But do you know how, in, how inconvenient this is? It is incredible what is going on right now 
uh, it with a lot of different things, things you've never thought about. I know a friend that's looking for a very specific faucet uh, for food processing, very specific. He thought he could get one, nowhere to be found now, hasn't been called back, oh my word. So what I'm saying is, is I really wanna push this and I know you've heard about everybody beating the drum about supply chain issues. Okay, we always think that uh, we're talking about food or maybe just like diapers or formula, which maybe formula, who would have ever thought that? I mean, really? But I'm telling you right now, if you need something for your home, now I'm not telling you to go run your Discover up and uh, buy things that you don't need, but I'm telling you right now, if there's something you need to get done, especially right now here in, 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 in our part of the world when it's still relatively pretty warm, if there's something you need to get looked at, fixed, or whatever, please get on it. I still don't have a hand pump on my well yet. Uh, I have a beautiful well reconnect. We, we're on well water, everything is good, but I got a hand pump from Simple Pump. I will be showing it, and I told them I will be showing it, but I will only be showing it when it's installed. They're so backed up, they can't even get here. I mean, and they've called it, they've been in touch, we know. It is that long of a waiting period. So not only do you have the issue of getting items, it's also getting help. Because like I said, the guys that um, are helping us with our home right now, doing things we can't do or we need help with, we contacted them in January. They came out finally the 1st of April, looked at everything, gave us an estimate. It's August 25th. And not only that, now we're running into, okay, now that we're on the, we're on the, we're on their calendar and they're here, you know, we're holding up their calendar. They've got more jobs to go to. Now we're having trouble getting items. We're gonna make it work. Lord's got us and I know that, but I'm telling you, we have ran ragged today. Uh, we've been running ragged the last two nights, just trying to make sure that, you know, we're getting items that we need. It may not be the items that we want the most. Uh, we're getting what we can afford, what makes the most sense, and we're going on with it because I don't know about you, but I feel like this country is just being driven off of a cliff. And I'm not gonna get into a debate about it, but I'm gonna tell you what right now, I'm gonna say this and say this, and you can give me a high five or a punch in the nose through the, through the screen, but I paid my school loans off. Mm. So I did, sold everything off, and I'm, I'm so irritated about this whole thing. Anybody that thinks, I'm getting a little sidetracked here, but anybody that thinks what's going on with this school loan payoff is going to help the country and help your world in the long run well yeah you're smarter than if you're that call it if you if you're that educated shouldn't you be smarter than that because they're driving us off of a cliff inflation on top of inflation doesn't help anything and it's going to go back to hurting jobs hurting the economy hurting us hurting the supply chain because again Inflation is choking us. I'll leave it there, because I'm sure, I, <laughs> I'm too busy chasing bathtubs right now to argue with anybody about this stuff. But I wanna let you know that yes, it is obvious that you should be supplying your pantry. That's my main thing. I wanna make sure people are safe and that they eat, okay? But I am saying again, here we are. It took us over a year to get our well done. It took us, um, six to eight months to get our wood stove here and installed. Now I'm just simply trying, hello, I'm just trying to fix a little bathtub. You would think this stuff is everywhere. No, it's not. No, it's not. And if it's available, you may have to wait a month or three months or you're gonna have to drive a long ways to get it, okay? And I don't know what in the world's going on with all that. Uh, you know, what I really think is going on is because we've had such this boom my, my thought is, is we've had such a huge boom in houses being built, especially here in, in Tennessee, East Tennessee, and in all in the Southeast, because everybody and their mom is flocking here because they don't like where they live right now. And I don't blame you. But at the same time, so things are being built really, really fast. So all of these kits and all of these standard sizes are being, have just been snatched up, is our guess. And then manufacturing maybe has slowed down and now things are starting to slow down. I don't know, what do you think? What are you seeing? Some of you out there are builders and contractors and you know, but I'm telling you right now, for somebody to say there's not an issue, uh, show up and I'll show you that there is. There are some serious issues. 
And not only that, but then again, you have to compete with prices on certain things as well, depending on what you're getting. So I just want to know that I made a video in the midst of all of this chaos. If you have something that you need to get filled, fixed, replaced, checked, if it's all about especially this basic function of your house, your car, your safety, please get on it. Do not delay. Do not delay. We didn't try to delay. The chaos that we're in has delayed us, and I don't see it getting any better. Okay? So I just want to know I said that. We got videos coming up, but I got to get all this stuff squared away. It's very distracting. And it's very time consuming. And I know once it's done, and eventually when it's done, we're going to be happy. And our home is going to be safer and more efficient and functional. And I don't have to worry about water dripping into my basement. But that's what I'm saying. If you're having these problems, please get on it. Because number one, like I said, what if it gets worse? Then it gets more expensive. What if you can't get anybody in the next two weeks to come help you? Um, what if there's a certain piece that you need and you just think, oh, the plumber's going to get it or, oop, the contractor's going to get it or, oop, but Bubba's going to get it and then Bubba can't find it. <laughs> it's really a problem. And again, they're driving us off of a cliff. I just don't see how this is going to get any better. In fact, to be honest with you, I think it's still deliberate. Or, excuse me, I... <laughs> I'm telling you it's deliberate. Do the best you can out there. Stay busy. Keep moving. And every single day, know that you are doing some type of prep work. Prep work. If you're not like me, I have to tell myself today, I'm not getting my potatoes in the cans today. Okay, true. But you know what? I'm making sure that my home is safer. And, you know, my windows are, are, are a little bit more, a little better sealed. And, you know, I'm making sure that we're safe. Everything counts. Everything matters. Just stay on the path. Hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for all the new views and comments and emails and everything out there. I'm seeing all of your emails. And again, clearly we're having a, tro uh, a troublesome time with taters because you all have responded to that and the emails that I just opened up this afternoon in regards to yesterday's video uh, is tremendous, uh, seriously. Don't delay on anything. And uh, remember, taking care of you and your family is number one because no one, no one's gonna be able to come and help you because we're all in that same boat and we're gonna keep going. Like, subscribe and share. We appreciate you. We'll see you on the next video.